Hey everyone! Welcome to my garden station and um, today I'm making some Korean Holly medicine bundles and um, I'm really excited about these medicine bundles because uh, they're all made with um, local herbs and plants that are found on my land and um, I'm working with some Korean Holly and Holly has been known as one of the most magical and medicinal plants all over the world, not just in Korea or China, but uh, the druids would use it to make their magical wands and staffs and prayer sticks. The Native Americans would use holly uh, to make a tea out of. It, it's a very robust and energizing tea that they would drink every morning like we do coffee. Now I haven't tried that yet, but that's definitely something I want to try. and. Um, if you study the uh, magical history and uh, properties of holly, you'll see that it's been widely used. It's an evergreen plant that is um, known to be a gift from the Great Spirit. So I've been working with this ever since I moved in and been studying with it. And um, it's been one of my favorite plants that I have in my yard. And it's amazing because um, the variety that I'm working with is the Korean variety, which is also where my people are from. And um, my grandma is from Korea. And I have four of these trees, one on each corner of my property. So um, there is definitely a, um, a connection there that um, these trees want to be around me and I'm meant to be around them. So I'm making these medicine bundles, which takes lots of preparation to make, and I'm gonna get into that, but I wanna share a little bit with you of the medicine that the holly carries, because holly is a very powerful plant. It is the plant of the spiritual warrior. And if you don't know me yet, or if you don't know me um, by now, uh, that is my namesake, Brian. Uh, the meaning of my name is the spiritual warrior. And um, I created a video on that. If you haven't seen that, um, I would check that out because that's pretty cool. It gets you a little glimpse into who I am and who stands behind me and what I'm here to do. So uh, it's very interesting that I'm working with the Korean Holly that shares the same properties that is my namesake. And um, it's also great for protection. So this is a, a plant that's much like sage. It's used for great protection. The druids would decorate their houses with holly in the winter time to protect them. And um, there is no coincidence that the entertainment industry, Hollywood, is named after the holly because it is a very magical plant and so um, let's talk about uh, some of its properties um, so here I have um, this is some that I've just collected and uh, I collect the holly uh, only from the ground I don't take it off the tree I let the tree gift it to me so um, and I only collect the green. Oh my god, look, there's this, I think, a cicada right here. Do you guys see that? Hi, little baby. Oh, they're so cool. I love that. I mean, they, they stay in the ground for 17 years, and then they have one chance to live their life. And so um, it's just such a beautiful expression of freedom and joy. They're... They crawl out of the ground after 17 years of, um, of doing what they're doing, of forming, of transforming in the ground. And then they come out into this sunny open air environment and sing their song and find their mates. So I just think that's, that's such a beautiful love story. So uh, a little tangent there. Um, I got some support from the cicadas and um, I think that's so cool. So um, back to the holly, 
Um, I just collected some and I only collect it from the ground because I let the tree gift it to me. Um, I don't take it off the tree and I only collect the green leaves because those are the ones that still have the life force energy in them. The brown ones have already started their transition so I leave the brown ones on the ground um, to transition back to the earth but the green ones in the black pail right here I dry out for a week under the Florida sun. So they spend their time drying out and they keep their green color, which is really nice. And um, something I forgot to mention about the holly is it's said to awaken the divine Christ consciousness with from within. So I'm not talking about like the religious dogmatic Christ consciousness. I'm talking about the divine spiritual Christ consciousness. This plant is deeply connected with the energies of Christ consciousness, which is said to be coming back, and it is coming back. We see it everywhere, or at least I do. So if you don't see it, uh, you will now. And uh, this medicine will help you connect with it and awaken that within you. It's also said to awaken or not to awaken but to open portals to the angelic and fairy realms so this is a very powerful medicine and i'm so fortunate and lucky to be able to work with it and so once i have this dry once this is dried out for a week um then i get a salt bath so they all get a salt bath in pink himalayan salt um organic of course and um, this helps to cleanse and purify and get them ready for the medicine bundles. And here in this basket I have um, Korean holly leaves that are ready for the medicine bundles. Now this is very different from sage because sage you can just clip the branch and um, clip a few branches and tie them up and make a very quick and easy medicine bundle. But these are loose leaf so it, it's a little bit more um, preparation and a little bit more skill to get them into a medicine bundle. So I wrap them with dried canna leaves and these are Indian shot canna leaves and uh, these are very special for me because they were um, my grandmother's dying gift for me and my grandma loved these flowers and she had them in her yard and before she died, she said that she wanted me to have them for my new house. And so I've created a tribute garden to my grandma. And so there is a very divine, powerful, and sacred energy and bond between grandparent and grandchild that's sewn into these canna lilies. And um, you can feel it. And it's powerful. And canna lilies are known for, um, they represent a strong, bright, and solid future. So it is such a special gift that my grandmother has given to me. And um, they're also known for purifying their environments. So they purify the environments that they're in. So it's a great um, wrap wrapping and a great pairing with the Korean holly. So I wrap the Korean holly leaves in the Indian long shot canna lily leaves. And I also put in some um, holly twigs right here. And it's really important. Um, these add some strength to the, to the medicine, um, but they have to be very fine twigs. If they're too thick, um, I have a thick one out here. This one's probably a little too thick. Um, it's not gonna burn as cleanly or as nicely. So we wanted to have some thin twigs. So I collect these off of the ground as well. Um, so that adds to the holly medicine because the holly medicine, the leaf has a different quality to the stick. So both are have the essence of holly and the medicinal uh, magical qualities of holly but they're different and you can see it I mean one has a little bit more strength and rigidity and um, is the the holding force that holds the leaves 
and the leaves are the expression of the plant and um, the energy centers of the plant that collect the energy from the sun. And so there's different qualities to the uh, Korean holly, but I put both of those in there, mix it with the Indian shot canna lily. I also add in a, a purple leaf heart and uh, purple leaf or purple heart uh, is a very powerful plant that is known for its bravery, its courage, and its mighty power. And even the highest military award uh, possible is named after this plant, the purple heart. So uh, as you can tell, there's lots of powerful medicine into this bundle. And so I put that in there as well. And then I also add just some local uh, wildflowers. And wildflowers are a wild, local, natural medicine of beauty and grace all on its own. And so um, they add a beautiful and graceful quality, quality to them. And um, it's the local medicine of the land. And if you think about it, everything in the world is medicine. You just have to learn it and to connect with it and to speak with it and it'll tell you its medicinal qualities. And every, every living thing on this planet, because we're living on a conscious living planet, has a consciousness. It has an intelligence. It communicates differently than us. Its intelligence is different from us but it is no less intelligent than us. In fact, I think they are more intelligent than us human beings. If we look at the behavior of human beings and we look at the behavior of plants, plants are far more intelligent than uh, we are. So there's lots of medicinal properties that we can tap into. And um, some are world renowned, like the holly and the canna lily and some are very local, like the wildflowers. And both are unique, and both are powerful, and both have their own medicine that they carry. So I can't wait for you guys to try these medicine bundles out for yourself. Uh, it's such a delight to make these, and um, I love making these. They're made with love and joy and intention and purpose. And uh, it's a very unique medicine bundle that you can't find anywhere else. So um, I hope you guys enjoy learning about how I make these medicine bundles. And um, I can't wait for you to try them out for yourself. All right. Thank you for listening. Bye, guys.